The things I want to talk about are the best mosquito nets. Hi, I'm Gilia Bisaki from the Bisaki.it blog. The best mosquito nets are divided into three categories. The first are the spring-operated ones, the second are the panel ones, and the third are the projected ones. The spring-operated ones are the most commonly used ones. There are versions for windows that open up and down. These are called spring verticals. The horizontal ones are for French doors. You need to pay attention to two details. The first is the spring, as it can be very dangerous. If it snaps back, it risks hurting people, even when children aren't around. And they're particularly easy to break because this spring goes through the gaps that are inside the mosquito net. So always choose a slow release version. The other thing you need to be careful about is that for French doors, you need to pick a model without a floor track. So we don't want the floor with the huge tripping hazard, which is also the one that creates danger because there have been mosquito nets here for 20 years without a floor guide or with a flat guide. So we're talking about a thickness of only three, four millimeters. They're not only dangerous, they're also much more comfortable because they're so-called frictional. It's a bit like what happens with the vertical ones, they move slowly. When you open them, you open half of them and you can also stop halfway. The second category, we said, are the panel ones. These mosquito nets don't have any specific features. You can make sliding panels, two or three or four panels. You can adapt them when it doesn't look dark outside because otherwise they won't open or fixed panels, a bit American style, or even used in northern countries. Removable panels are made that I assemble in summer and disassemble in winter. The third category of mosquito nets are the prizetate. Prizetates are mosquito nets, the ones that have all the mesh between one hole and another, and they have advantages, the first being the size. I can make things very large and very high. I could enclose a balcony, for example, something unthinkable with other mosquito nets. And another advantage still linked to size is that they have very, very small thicknesses. So I can mount them in places where other mosquito nets maybe can't even mount. They cast a small shadow and I can make very, very large dimensions. I can also handle four meters, five meters. Let's think about a loggia where there are a few windows behind it. Instead of placing mosquito nets in the windows, maybe I'll put them in the loggia. This is possible with presented mosquito nets. Another advantage is also precision and safety because there is no spring. There is no marketing organ, so it is easy to use even for children. It doesn't create any issues.